But we start now at 11 o'clock tonight with a crucial question. Less than two weeks away from Election Day, we're seeing long lines at some local polling places. So we are asking who is voting early and what has them so eager to line up to cast a ballot? In most of Central Florida, early voting will kick off its fourth day at 7 in the morning. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Ginger Gadsden. Glad you're with us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. We know interest is always higher when the White House is up for grabs. It's the way it goes. But new numbers just in tonight show about 661,000 Central Floridians have already cast their ballots. More than half are by mail but nearly 290,000 of you have already waited in person to make your voice heard. That's more than three times the turnout at this same time in 2022. News 6's Troy Campbell is out talking to voters. We're still 13 days from Election Day, but you might not know that by looking at this line of early voters here at the Alafaya Branch Library. The line of the after work rush stretching all the way through the parking lot. Bob, why was it so important for you to come out and early vote? Because of what we're facing. Um, the facing uh, corruption from the top to the bottom, and uh, it can only get worse. Orange County early voter Bob Jones says he's voting for his future grandchildren. All the other people here, did it make you feel good to know your other community members? They also are out here voting. Yes, indeed. Explain. Well, uh, let's do civic duty. Others say they don't want to take any chance of having something come up on Election Day that could prevent them from turning out. Why is it so important for you to vote today instead of November 5th? Well, it's vital that we vote today because we stop freaking out that maybe our vote is we're going to be too late or we won't get out work in time and we need to make sure that we voted for this election more than any other. Check out these early voting numbers for each Central Florida County as of Wednesday. According to the Florida Division of Elections, Lisa Lewis is the Volusia County Supervisor of Elections and says the county is averaging a record of 11,000 early votes cast each day. What's your response when I tell you we just came from an early voting location in Orange County and there was probably at least 100 people outside in line? What does that say? Are we seeing that in Volusia as well? Yes, we are actually. Early voter Anna Maroof says she's setting an example for her children. Why is it important for you to bring the kids out here and let them see the process? Absolutely. Um, I think it's really important to um, show our children how important it is to take part in our democratic process. In Orange County, Troy Campbell, Getting Results, News 6. And we are taking a much deeper dive into those early voting numbers online. Just head to clickorlando.com. Every night at 9, we're updating voting totals, breaking down which party has the edge county by county. Look inside our voting guide at clickorlando.com slash results 2024.